So the chip, which is the CPU, has the central processing unit. That's where everything starts, everything happens, right? So the chip is actually going to sit on the motherboard. The motherboard is going to tell and source and send everything where it needs to go. The one that we have here is the eighth gen. It's the 8700K. It is a quad core i7 uh, with 12 meg of cache. Um, it's a 3.7 gigahertz chip. This is a great chip for gaming and a great chip for doing a lot of different things with, um, because it's an i7, uh, it is a quad core, which means that it has four separate cores that it can use to actually do the processing. So when you're doing gaming and you're running it at maximum, this chip is gonna handle it just fine. All right, so now what we're going to do is put in the uh, the CPU, uh, which is one of the most important parts. Uh, we're gonna install the 8700K chip, which is relatively easy. First, you have to remove the plastic protector. Uh, first, you're going to push down on the bar and pull it out, and then push it all the way up to the top of the case, and you'll see the, 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 the bracket actually fold up. And then you pull apart plastic black piece. Don't try and pull it apart while it's actually still mounted to the motherboard because you might bend some of the pins. You can see on the motherboard you have an arrow pointing to the direction that the chip should be oriented. You'll then take the CPU that you have, orient the arrow in the same direction, and then mount it. Now that it's in, Bernie's going to slowly push down the, the bracket not to let it snap onto the chip. Once you slide the bracket underneath the pressure screw, you'll then be able to lower down the arm and tuck it back underneath the holder uh, securely, just like it should be. Now that you have that all set and squared away, you should be good to go with your CPU.